Hello, my name is David Langford. I'm Director of Athletics at the Metropolitan Campus at Fairleigh Dickinson University, and this is the March 2013 edition of the Yellow Book Roundup. The fencing team got off to a great start this year, comp competing well locally and regionally. In January, the team traveled to Chicago to compete at the Northwestern Invitational. They did extremely well, and they beat Notre Dame in the Sabre event. They came back to New Jersey, competed in the NIWFA Championships, where the team finished in fourth place, the highest finish they've had for some time, and Sophia Bischoff was the champion in her event. Women's basketball team got off to a fast start early in the season, um, competed very well early in the Northeast Conference events, and then um, ran into some difficulty down the stretch, just missing uh, the NEC tournament. Uh, Erica Livermore, however, was named All-Conference, and it's the second year in a row that she was recognized by the Northeast Conference. The men's basketball team played very well in the non-conference portion of the season. When we got into Northeast Conference play, the team struggled uh, finding it difficult to stay consistent throughout each game. The highlight of the season was Keenu Rochford, who led the Northeast Conference in rebounds and field goal shooting percentage. The bowling team, which plays a very competitive schedule, has done extremely well so far this season, highlighted by the fact that they just won their third consecutive Northeast Conference regular season championship. The men's and women's track and field team is experiencing a resurgence. On the men's side, freshman Jasper Savoy and Darrell Gooding are leading the charge, both qualifying for IC4A championship competition. On the women's side, Juanya Freeland has shattered the weight throw records uh, and won the Northeast Conference championship in the weight throw. We've added two new coaches to our roster of head coaches. Uh, Rick Staten has taken over the women's soccer program and already the team uh, ex is excited about their prospects of the future. They're training really hard and seem to be having a lot of fun at the same time. Uh, on the softball side, we've added Candy Letts, who came in almost at the last minute and has created a very positive atmosphere for our, soc our softball team, and they're doing very well in competition so far. In February, the athletic department celebrated its 11th consecutive semester of semester grade point averages over 3.20. The entire athletic department did extremely well in the classroom. 15 of our 19 teams earned semester grade point averages over 3.0. We've promised our student athletes that every semester that they do that, that they make that milestone, that we will have a dinner to commemorate that achievement. What is even more satisfying is that for the third consecutive semester, both the semester GPA for the department as well as the cumulative GPA for the department was over 3.2. Again, my name is David Langford, Director of Athletics at the Metropolitan Campus at Fairleigh Dickinson University, and this has been the March edition of the Yellow Book Roundup. See you again next month.